In their moments of distress, our children benefit most when we let them know that we see and hear what they're feeling without trying to fix anything or cheer them up. In the following scene, a father tunes in with empathy, what we call empathic listening, without trying to make his daughter's distress go away. He knows that advice and problem solving are best received after emotions have settled down. That team really sucks. What happened? I didn't make the team. The coach says I'm not ready. That's bullshit. He doesn't know what he's talking about. I hate him. I hear how angry you are. I can hear it in your voice. Uh, you're angry at the coach, feeling let down by him, disappointed in him. I can understand that. Dad resists the urge to offer his daughter advice or try to cheer her up. He wisely knows it's more important to tune in through empathic listening to what she's feeling, specifically naming her anger and her disappointment. This is how the daughter feels seen and heard in her moment of distress, understood and supported by her father. I know I'm ready. I worked real hard this year and never missed practice. You did work hard. It's not right. He's a jerk. You did work hard. You're really disappointed and upset. Yeah, I'm really disappointed. I can see why you're so disappointed. I'm feeling badly this happened to you. The bond between this father and daughter is strengthened in this scene when he shows her that he can truly understand what she's feeling. It's an experience that reminds her that she can go to him in times of distress. And she learns through his example the value of offering empathy to the people in our lives.